Hey guys, it's me Talha. In this video, we are going to talk about the graphics settings in Revit. And in this video, I will be showing you how to create blueprint style architectural drawings using only Revit. We will not use Photoshop or any other softwares to create this. Everything will be done in Revit. Now, if you want to learn advanced 3D modeling in Revit, you can check out the courses on my website learnrevitonline.com. And if you want to download all my Revit project files, you can get them from my Patreon. All the links are in the description. Now let's get started. So here I have already opened this project and the Revit families which you are seeing here uh, were downloaded from Blocks plugin. And if you, if you want to download this plugin, you can check out the link in the description. Anyway, to create the blueprint uh, effect here, we first need to change the visual style to hidden line. And now we can change the background color to do that we can go to file options and go to graphics here and here we have background color we want to change it uh, let's put a color code here put 5 here and 80 in the green and blue will be 150 so this is the color which we are going to get if you don't want to use this color code you can choose uh, the color from here anyway let's click ok and ok again there you go it's already looking pretty good now i want to edit the walls because uh, i only want to show the outlines of the walls so to do that we need to edit the visual settings so let's press vg on the keyboard to open up this visibility graphics dialog box now here let's look for the walls you can just select any of these and press w on the keyboard to go to the walls here now uh, in the patterns column here we want to remove the pattern so just select no override from this uh, drop down click ok and i want to change the thickness of the lines as well so for that uh, in the lines we have to click here and here we have the line weight let's increase it let's select 2 click ok ok again there you go only the outlines of the walls are visible here now uh, if you notice the line thickness did not change the reason for that is thin lines is on here if i turn it off uh, you will be able to see actual thickness of the lines now to change the color of this uh, of the dimensions we just need to uh, select any of the dimensions then go to the properties and if i scroll down here we have color let's change it we just need to make it black as well because since we applied a different color to the background here revit will uh, change all the black objects into white so you need to keep that in mind if you select black it will appear white here so let's select black color click ok okay again there you go we got the white uh, dimensions here now let's export this image but before that i will just quickly hide the dimensions because i don't want to export the dimensions for now so let's hide the category perfect now before exporting this image you need to make sure you don't have any objects uh, in your view which you don't want to export like i have this elevation view symbols which I don't want to show in the uh, which I don't want to export with the plan so let's quickly hide them let's select all four of these then right click hide in view elements perfect let's just press ZE on the keyboard to make sure there is no uh, any other objects uh, in your screen now we can export this plan so let's go to file export just hover over this little arrow here and go to images and animations then select image from this menu here uh, first we need to set the location where we want to export the file so let's select this folder and select zoom to from here and make it 100 percent and then you can uh, choose the file format i will just leave it uh, jpeg uh, medium and then we have the image quality let's select 300 if you want you can go for higher quality but 300 also works fine now here just make sure current window is selected in the export range now click ok there you go let's check that 
here we have it it's looking very nice now if you want to return back to the default Revit settings you just need to repeat the same process just go to file options then graphics and uh, just change the background color to white as it was before now click ok click again there you go so that's how easy it is to create blueprint style drawings in Revit so that's all I wanted to share with you guys today so that's it for this video I hope you have learned something new so please make sure to like and share this video and subscribe to my channel if you haven't already don't forget to turn on the post notifications and don't forget to check out my website learnrevitonline.com to get my Revit advanced courses and yeah I will see you guys in the next video